Hello MacWarriors, how is it going? Welcome to your daily dose of MacWarrior Online. Today we are playing The Adder because I wanted to put myself on a challenge and The Adder is actually great for that. Now what is The Adder? The Adder is a light mech, a 35 ton clan mech which is super slow. So we have a, a clan XL engine 210. So we are running uh, only 97 kph in a uh, light mech. So this is, uh, this is not super fast but at the same time by sacrificing a lot of engine weight we can and take a lot of weapons here so we have kind of a glass cannon as you can see our structure and, and our um, armor is relatively low because again we are running a light mag but our firepower is 46 and that is cool so we are running a heavy large laser and uh, four ER medium lasers and um, our left and right arm they give us actually some re very nice um, quirks for the build we have a minus six percent laser duration which is great for the heavy larges and or for uh, heavy lasers in general because they have a very lengthy duration and that one is is getting down to um, 1.2 or 1.3 seconds now instead of 1.55 so that's a very big benefit and the other one has uh, energy cooldown quirk of minus two percent it's a little bit at least so um, again as I said um, it is a glass cannon it has a lot of alpha strike and to bear that alpha strike we need to go for a lot of heat sinks we are running 18 here which is I would say just on the edge but it is it is okay you could take another heat sink if you sacrifice the light active probe so I only have that in here because I had a half a spare ton left and if you go for something like this so you go down to one maybe and here 27 and 27 and then you can take another one um, but I didn't dare to, to, to strip the legs down to 27 on the adder because again it has no mobility and uh, <laughs> if you get shot uh, in the leg and you cannot maneuver anymore it is uh, it is bad. It is really bad. Um, but the light active probe, it makes it so that we have a 15% targeting time boost, which is great to target weak spots. And it, of course, counts as ECM in 90 meter range. And that is very great. Our skill build looks like this. We have everything invested into the firepower because, again, glass cannon means um, improving or increasing DPS and alpha strike and you know our uh, general fighting capabilities we have all the cooldown we have all the heat gen we have all the range we have of course all the laser durations and uh, as you can see we are going completely nutty on the firepower tree skip survivability because I do not want to get shot anyway so I try to um, use my mobility and positioning to avoid fire so this is the play style of this mech here uh, I skip mobility uh, also because Again, I wanted to have firepower maxed out, but then we have operations to keep the damage going. We have heat containment and the cool runs here. We are running uh, radar deprivation and both seismic sensors because, again, I do not want to get backstabbed at all or I do not want to have anything near me. And if there is something coming up, I want to be aware of that and therefore seismic sensor. It is kind of a stand and shoot and then repositioning and shoot again mech. You will see that in the games. And we are running double cool run. Um, to cool the mech down to amplify our DPS and we are running a double artillery strike and that's the build everybody I wish you all a lot of fun in the two games that are coming and if you have that don't forget to leave a rating or subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and now it's time to hit the battlefield all right first game of the day we are playing polar highlands we are playing domination polar highlands is actually pretty good because of this Ah, oh, 42% heat! But the heat dissipation, as you can see, is great. So until our large pulse laser, or no, heavy large laser is ready again, we are almost back to zero. So that's really cool. And uh, yeah, we are going over to the circle and see what we can make happen there. A uh, little little bit of a slight note. Uh, there's another another sun story. So um, uh, as you might know, I have a son. And um, um, recently one of his uh, friends, his kindergarten friends, um, gave him a uh, friendship book. So I don't know if you know those books where you... Just uh, just write in your name and, and, and what hobbies you have and, and what's your favorite color and what you like and what you don't like. Just some, you know, personal personal questionnaire thing. Um, so he, he got that book from, from uh, one of his friends on, from the kindergarten and we were browsing through the book. <laughs> that was so good because we wanted to see what the other parents and the other children put in there. It's actually only the parents that did that. Um, because of course uh, kindergarten children cannot write on their own. Uh, point being, point being, um, the first entry that we saw is uh, what is special about me. So the very first page, what is special about me? And um, the parents of the child wrote in there that I can speak so well. <laughs> this is so <laughs> hilarious. Oh, they are so proud that they should, that they need to write it into into a friendship book. I found that hilarious. It's like like. 
I could write into my uh, into the hobbies of my child uh, that he really likes physics and playing the piano and, and, and doing arts and stuff. Like, seriously? What is special about me? You write something like, I don't know, you have bright, bright green eyes or something like that, but not that I can speak so well. This is like, like bragging about your child in a children's friendship book. Don't do that. <laughs> I don't know, I kind of found that a little bit uh, too much. But, yeah, just parents things. Just parent things. So what we want to do is kind of this year. I'm doing it all the time already. So we we want to use our mid-range alpha strike potential to uh, destroy enemies, and that's exactly what we are doing. In the meantime, um, trying to get angles, and you know, I do not want to stay in one spot for more than 10 seconds. This is uh, kind of the playstyle of the adder because it's extremely squishy, and you pop out out of nowhere, you shoot, and then you get back to second line. Okay, we got an Annihilator. That Annihilator is not relevant to the fight. Let's let's ignore him for a while. Or kill him fast. Uh, okay, we go for the kill him fast thing. Alright. Yeah, in the meantime, we are getting wrecked from, from the, the back there. The, again, this Annihilator is absolutely not relevant. 100% not. Also, that Jägermech is only Dakaing. Alright, guys, you want him. I want to help you out here because, obviously, my team is putting so much effort into that Annihilator that he needs to die fast. That Cicada, however, is, pre is a pretty good target. Speaking about not being in uh, the same spot for 10 or more seconds, yes, I ignored that. And, um, oh guys, there's a Cicada. If you see a Cicada, kill him. He's one shot center torso. Turn around now, Hotel 9. Oh, boys. Boys. Pushing us now. Okay, defensive artillery, and then we, we have to do NASCAR now. Um, it's three and three. I don't know if that's what that was worth it, guys. I have no idea if that that was a good idea. I don't think so, actually. To be honest, I believe I strongly believe that it was a bad idea. Still three and three. This Jägermeck is very nasty. I'm gonna shoot him with that. Um, and then we go over to I don't know. I need a target, and I need artillery. But there's a cicada. And it's an Irby. Uh, we got the Irby. That's good. I want that cicada though. Oh, what? My mouse. Ah, oh, my mouse got stuck. Uh, hello? Wait, wait, wait. Ah, I couldn't. I couldn't. I was hoping for a backstrike here. Okay, we, we got it. Um, hmm. Scary target. I need to be a little bit of aware, uh, aware of my heat now. Uh, I want that artillery over here. We go for this. Cannot do anything more. Uh, there's a cicada on the left side. I want to get him. Um, I believe my dude. No, no. My, uh, do you need help? Now. Yeah, just waiting for the right moment here. Just trying to oh, dodge this. Oh my god, no, 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 no. Okay, Madcat is without weapons, that's good. Ignore the Madcat, he's a stick, please. Um, Go for the Grasshopper instead, or the Cicada. Oh, they have a UAV up here. Go for this guy. He's scary. This is a really tough fight here. It's 8 and 7. However, again, the Madcat is out of the fight, so it's basically 9 and 7. Yeah, just like that. Ugh, not the best laser burn. I'm doing what I can do here. Open up the side for the machine gun fire that is coming in. Yeah, I guess we have it. Yeah, we definitely should have it. It's a PPC build, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna get closer than 90 meters to underrun him. Hi. Could you stop, please? Could you stop for a second? Nah, I shouldn't have done that. I should not have done it. I thought it was in the back, guys. Where's my Hellbringer? <laughs> Mistakes were made! Mistakes were made! Oh my god! Why did I do that? Shit! Sorry! <laughs> oh man! <laughs> Holy crap! Oh my god! Sorry guys, I'm, I'm... 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 That was a mistake! I should have played it safer. I should have stayed in the second line and, and get more shots of opportunities here. Instead, I was super. I was so confident that we had it in the back because we were ahead by two in the late, and we couldn't bring it to the end. Wow! 
Well, that was partly on me here, guys. That loss, I kind of threw it here. Have to say that. Mm, sorry, team. <laughs> but yeah, let's have a look at the end score before we go over to the next video or for the next uh, game. Uh, as you can see, build is strong. <laughs> If you uh, if you have enough time and cooling around you, so we have 732 damage on a light mag with one killing blow, nine assists, one kill most damage dead, and two components destroyed. That's the first round. Let's go over to the next one and see how this will go down. All right, a second game of the day. We are playing the Mining Collective. We are playing Dom Nom Nomination, and yeah, last game was okay. crazy. That was hmm. <laughs> okay. okay. Right. Anyway, let's go ahead and do the good old rotation thing. Go to Delta Five. Shoot over to Stop Delta Four, not shoot over, but go over to Delta Four and then shoot into Echo Four. That's what I want to do here. So let's see if that's gonna work out. We are quite fast. I mean, we are a light at all, and um, yeah, we have 97 kph, which is actually slow for a light, but it is fast enough <laughs> to get into position early. Ha! Ha! Saw you. I think I dealt more damage to him than he dealt to me. <laughs> I lost five percent of my armor though because of that move. And yes, adders are squishy. They are super super squishy so uh do not engage the enemy directly face to face you need to have somebody around to take it for you and then you can deal the damage um yeah so it, it is a damage dealing mech not not a tank no not a skirmisher just a plain damage dealing mech so there's a mauler we wait for him to come up here okay a little bit of splash damage to him uh, I'll, I'll take the uav there's a phoenix uh maybe not now? Okay, we got it. New target acquired. Um, there's a Phoenix Hawk, you say? Okay. I got artillery for him. And now I want to go back to the Mauler, because that guy needs acquired. damage. And yes, I said earlier that the Annihilator is not relevant to the fight, but you know what? That Mauler is. New oh, wait. Better. Acquired. Way better. We're just gonna harass their assault max while they are advancing here. And I really hope they do not know that I am here. Online. Got another Arty Strike. Oh, wait. <laughs> okay. I wanted to drop my artillery there. Sadly, I couldn't. Oh, that's a supernova. And yes, we open up side horses here big time. Alright, never mind. And I'm blocked! I'm blocked! I'm blocked! No! No! Please, don't! Don't do that when I'm doing that! Ah! <laughs> Sheep! Sheep! Uh, yeah, right. Now we are pinned. Um, guys, we have a pin situation. We need to push out somewhere. Okay, but I'm, what I can do, however, is this here. Destroy the Wolverine, or maybe try. And my side torso is open. Ooh, movement, positioning. We do not have any of this. Okay, let's go for this. This is important. Took too long, took too long. Is there anybody behind me? <gasps> the Phoenix Hawk. Let's go. Guys, let's push out. Uh, Echo 5. Do something, but this is bad. It's really bad here. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Acquired. Oh wait. Wait. There's an enemy. Down below. There he is. Hello? Ah, oh, the splash. Yeah, I should have toggled on arm lock, but we got a good amount of damage here. Ah, speaking of bad, actually, it's kind of working out here. We got some serious damage to that griffin with quad AC2. Holy cow. Um. But yeah, at the moment we have them in the choke point, so that's great. I Wolverine, just in or I don't know. I just take your light PPCs. That's fine. Um, man, my team is wrecking left and right, like that. I help you with the Jenner. Maybe, maybe. Oh. Okay, it's time for the first cool shot of the day. Okay, that was okay. -ish. Oh, he has small pulses. Not gonna work. Is that guy? Can we kill the Jenna, please? Behind you, Moving targets are bad. I tried. I tried. Oh, now the light mags are behind me. Woo, let's run. I got light mags on top behind me. They're chasing me. Kill them all. Alright, we got this going. And as you can see, this is so, so squishy. As soon as you get shot once, you are basically down. Um, yeah, about that. It's the commando. And he got me. Yeah, this is, this is, this is the adder for you. Guys, you, you will have fun if you have your team tanking for you. And if you if you have a nice skirmish going on and you can just set up somewhere and then shoot all the guys that are that are running down here. Um, 
On the other hand, if you're getting pushed or harassed by light mags, you are down. You're so, so dead. But it, it is fun to play because for a light mag, this, this little adder has so much damage potential. It is so, so oh, yeah, crazy. Right. It is a glass cannon. But if you play it like yeah. that and if you, if you have a good sense of, uh, of the battlefield, um, mobility of battlefield positioning, then uh, you, will, you will perform okay or well. Oh man, that was a good fight. I like that. I was, I was, I was so, so freaked out when the battle master pushed me, and the hunchback was blocking my my retreat vector there. <laughs> I was, holy cow! But anyway, we got three KMDD out of that. Cool. We got ten assists, five hundred and sixty-seven damage, and that's your daily dose, everybody. That was the adder with the laser vomit build. And if you like that, then don't forget to leave a rating or subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. If you want to support the channel and keep it going, then go down below to the description. There is the link to my Patreon page, and I hope to see you on the battlefield, everybody. Goodbye.